Hi, I'm Rachel Yatuzis, and I'm going to show you how to clean Tempur-Pedic foam. Tempur-Pedic foam is also called memory foam, um, obviously because when something is pushed against it, it leaves an impression. It'll take the mold of whatever part of your body is pressing against it. This is made for a computer chair or any kind of chair, and it helps support your back. So this is something that you want to keep clean, but the good thing about Tempur-Pedic foam is it doesn't harbor bacteria and mold as bad as a normal pillow would. Normal pillows really harbor bacteria and mold a lot more than Tempur-Pedic foam does. Um, but of course, as like anything, if it does get wet, it can grow mold in it, but this is how you clean it. And you want to do this every two or three months. It depends on how often you use it. If it's something that you sleep on, you definitely want to wash it as often as you do your comforter or your sheets. But since this wasn't just goes on a computer chair and nobody's drooling on it, then I would say every two or three months will be fine. You want to have some baking soda and you're going to sprinkle baking soda on here. This is going to absorb any odor and any moisture that may be in the foam. You may want to let it sit five or ten minutes, you know, depending on how dirty or how wet or moist the Tempur-Pedic Tempur foam may be. And next, you want to grab your vacuum. <clears throat> and this technique, I meant to mention, this technique works with mattresses, pillows, anything like that. This is a smaller pillow, you know, this is great for demonstration purposes, but if you have a large mattress, you're going to do this exactly the same. So. Grab your vacuum with the attachment, turn it on, and you're going to vacuum up all of the baking soda. Once you've done that, the last step is to just spot clean it. You don't clean Tempur-Pedic foam all at once. All you need to do is spot clean it. It does not get that dirty, and like I said, it doesn't harbor mold and bacteria the way other traditional mattresses and pillows do. So get a cup of dish soap, like a really mild dish soap, or if you have a mattress, use a bucket of dish soap and warm water, and get a sponge and just spot clean it. After you've spot cleaned all the little drool spots or whatever might be on it, in this case, I'll use paper towels. If you have a big, bigger product project, you want to use a bigger towel. But just press it onto the foam. And then get another dry or clean towel and let it sit overnight on the foam so as to absorb all the moisture and make sure it's completely dry. I'm Rachel Yatuzis, and that is how you clean Tempur-Pedic foam.